Hello everyone. Um, in this video, I'm gonna give you some tips about sound hole, guys. Uh, I think many of you guys watching this video probably already know about this, about the sound hole, about the placing, upgrading, and everything. But I, I was hoping to to help the very very beginners, uh, people who start. The game just now I don't know anything about it because I remember when I started I didn't know anything about it and I wish somebody told me the thing I'm going to tell you now guys so I'm hoping to help, to help uh, some people out there that would make me really happy so I'm gonna be talking about town hall so first <coughs> let's talk about placing the, uh, the town hall where do you want to place it? Well, probably in the beginning of the game, all you need is just to to grow your your base to upgrade uh, the walls, defenses, buildings, everything at all. So for that, you're gonna need a lot of loot, a lot of gold and elixir. So you don't care about trophies at that stage. And what you what you need to do is just place the town hall outside your base unpro unprotected and I'm gonna tell you why so everyone who destroys your town hall it gives you 12 hours of free shield so why is that important well during these 12 hours nobody can attack you so that's a really good point um, if no one can attack you, no one can steal your gold and elixir. So that's that's perfect. And and many people out there are looking for bases to attack for trophies. So if they see your base, they'll just pick up your town hall without attacking any aggressively and take your loot on the way for that. So placing your town hall outside, it's a great strategy for a farming base, just like mine. And you've got some more place in, in the middle of your base to, to protect your your elixir storages and and gold storages <clears throat> so this is one thing to you know the other thing is about the upgrading of your town hall you don't want to rush into the town hall you don't want to rush upgrading it many people go on the town hall and see the, the new features you, you get the new um, the new defenses the new buildings and that makes them makes them really excited. I remember how I felt, and I what I wanted was just upgrading the town the town hall all the time and, and getting the new the new buildings. But this is a very bad strategy. Why? Well, because there is a loot penalty when attacking someone. The the matchmaking it, it's not about the town halls. You can you can find a match with the town hall two levels lower than yours or two levels higher the matchmaking is about trophies so <clears throat> if you attack a town hall that is the same level as you as yours you can get a hundred percent of his resources by hundred percent I, I don't mean that you can steal all his resources you can steal just percentage of uh, his gold and collectors I'm not quite sure how much was it I, I think like 20 percent of his his uh gold let's say if you can steal a hundred k gold that's a hundred percent you can steal from that player who is the same town hall level as yours but if he was one uh, one level lower you get just 90 percent of this loot so you would have gotten like 90k loot from the same guy and if he was two levels lower than you you would have gotten just 50 percent which is just 50,000 gold so that's that's very important to know and when you rush into the town halls and you don't upgrade your defenses your base is it's fairly weak it's it's very weak to attack and for you it's it gets more difficult to find bases with good resources because as you go higher the bases become 
very strong and if your defenses are not upgraded the same town hall levels can attack your base and steal all of your resources so this is very important guys don't rush into the town hall just I'm not saying you have to max out every single building at your current town hall level but try to max out every single defense and to have fairly upgraded walls that's very important so I hope you guys find this uh, sort of educational video useful and I hope to help uh, some people out there that would make me really happy and if you if you enjoyed this video and if it helps you please make sure to like it and you can subscribe to my channel for more videos and as always guys thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video